subscribe. Click on the bell. Like, comment, share. Do you know the relationship between the number of a moles of a gas with its volume? To know the relationship, let us go deeper into the lesson. The mass of one mole of atoms is its relative atomic mass in grams. Click on each atom to see its relative atomic mass and mass of one mole of its atoms. Relative atomic mass for hydrogen is 1. Mass for one mole of hydrogen atom is 1 gram. Relative atomic mass for carbon is 12. Mass for one mole of carbon atom is 12 grams. Relative atomic mass for oxygen is 16. Mass for one mole of oxygen atom is 16 grams. Relative atomic mass for sodium is 23. Mass for one mole of sodium atom is 23 grams. The mass of one mole of molecule is its relative molecular mass in grams. Click on each molecule to see its relative molecular mass and the mass of one mole of its molecule. Mass for one mole of hydrogen is 2 grams. Mass for one mole of oxygen molecules is 32 grams. Mass for one mole of carbon dioxide molecules is 44 grams. Mass for one mole of chlorine molecules is 71 grams. Sometimes it is not practical to weigh gases as most of them are very light and difficult to weigh accurately. What other measurements can we use? We can measure the volumes. Let us look at the volume occupied by one mole of a gas at a given temperature and pressure. Click on hydrogen. The volume occupied by one mole of hydrogen is 22,400 cubic centimeters or 22.4 cubic decimeters at 0 degrees centigrade and 1 atmospheric pressure. This condition is known as the Standard Temperature and Pressure, or STP. Click on STP to know more information. The volume occupied by one mole of any gas at STP is known as the molar volume. Click on oxygen, carbon dioxide and chlorine to see their molar volume. One mole of gas contains the Avogadro number of particles. Click on the blinking button. One mole of gas contains 6.02 times 10 to the power of 23 particles. Hence, the molar volume of a gas also contains the Avogadro's number of particles. Click on the blinking button. Relative molecular mass of carbon dioxide gas is 44. One mole of carbon dioxide gas is 44 grams. One mole of carbon dioxide gas consists of 6.02 times 10 to the power of 23 molecules. One mole of carbon dioxide gas occupies 22.4 cubic decimeter at STP. Relative molecular mass of hydrogen gas is 2. One mole of hydrogen gas is 2 grams. One mole of hydrogen gas consists of 6.02 times 10 to the power of 23 molecules. One mole of hydrogen gas occupies 22.4 cubic decimeter at STP. Relative molecular mass of chlorine gas is 32. One mole of chlorine gas is 32 grams. 
one mole of chlorine gas consists of 6.02 times 10 to the power of 23 molecules. One mole of chlorine gas occupies 22.4 cubic decimeter at STP. Relative molecular mass of oxygen gas is 32. One mole of oxygen gas is 32 grams. One mole of oxygen gas consists of 6.02 times 10 to the power of 23 molecules. One mole of oxygen gas occupies 22.4 cubic decimeter at STP. The molar volume of a gas depends on the temperature and pressure. Click on condition to know the information. One mole of any gas always occupies the volume under the same temperature and pressure. Key in the correct molar volume at STP and room condition. Calculation of gas volume at STP and room conditions. If the mass of a gas is given, we must first calculate the number of moles for the gas. Click on step 1. The number of moles of hydrogen gas is equal to its mass divided by its relative molecular mass. Click step 2 to calculate its volume at STP. One mole of any gas at STP occupies 22.4 cubic decimeter, hence, two moles of hydrogen gas at STP occupies two times 22.4 cubic decimeter, which is equal to 44.8 cubic decimeter. Calculation of gas volume at STP and room conditions. Calculate the number of moles present in 560 cubic centimeter of carbon dioxide at STP. Let's say the number of moles present in 560 cubic centimeter of carbon dioxide at STP is Y. Y mole of carbon dioxide at STP is equal to 560 cubic centimeter. We know that one mole of gas at STP occupies 22,400 cubic centimeter. Hence, we can make an equation as shown. Thus, through calculation, we can find the value of Y. In this case, Y is equal to 0 0.025. Therefore, 0 0.025 mole carbon dioxide at STP occupies 560 cubic centimeter. In this lesson, you have learned about the relationship between the number of moles of a gas with its volume. Molar volume of a gas is one mole of any gas occupying 22.4 decimeter cube at STP. One mole of gas consists of 6.02 times 10 to the power of 23 particles, thus one molar volume of gas contains 6.02 times 10 to the power of 23 particles. The molar volume of any gas is the same at similar temperature and pressure. Number of moles of any gas times the molar volume equals to the volume of the gas. Volume of any gas divided by the molar volume equals to the number of moles of the gas. Click on the blinking button to proceed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell icon.